Hello out there to you. This is a somewhat difficult micro problem uh, that comes up from time to time. We're trying to minimize the cost. Uh, sometimes this is referred to as, as using the least cost rule. And so the least cost rule says that the producer is using the least cost combination of uh, labor and capital if uh, they produce to where the marginal product of labor divided by the wage equals the marginal product of capital divided by the price of capital. In this case, in this problem, that's pretty common. We're going to call that the rental rate of capital, or lowercase r. Really, so what we're, what we're looking at here is the additional output per worker unit or worker hour or something like that um, per what I pay them, per wage. Uh, of that period of time uh, needs to equal the additional output from capital divided by the price of capital, like how, how expensive is capital. And since since uh, firms generally borrow that money, that's why we refer to it as the rental rate of capital. Most firms don't buy the equipment that they use. So in this particular problem, uh, we're told that we're producing 5,000 futons. Uh, and so I'm just going to plug in MPL. Okay, so that's 100, and then divided by the wage, it tells you what the wage is. The wage is 5, okay, and this equals uh, 20. Okay. So this is like output per dollar, additional output per dollar. And then over here, uh, the this is 250 divided by the rental rate, which is $25, which is 10, and since... 20 does not equal 10, uh, we are not minimizing our costs. Okay, so we want to get these to be more equal. So it's not this answer. Okay, it can't be A. Okay, we can reduce the cost. Okay, so it wants to know if we want more labor or and less capital or more less labor and more capital. Okay, so which one is like more productive per dollar? Well, that's the labor side. So we want more labor and less capital. And why does that happen? Well, as we produce, um, as we use more labor, this number is going to go down. And if we produce less of this, or less with capital, this number is going to go up. So um, we would get closer to, if we sent this number down and this number up, we get closer to our condition that we're looking for when we're producing with the least cost, okay? Um, and so that's that's the answer. The answer is B, so that's how that, instead of use the least cost rule to get at the answer.